Hey guys, I'm LB, and Deathwish made a map seemingly specifically designed for me. Aeronautics and Rage Suppression Training for LB, with my Twitch underscores that I can't do anything about. Get to the exit with the optional companion cube that's not actually optional. Don't kill your companion because death is forever. The companion helper cube is there too, well, help the companion cube as well as preventing you from getting trapped on the catwalk of loneliness. Alright, Deathwish. What have you got me in for today? Okay, we have a... blank video monitor. Okay, so there's portal surfaces here, and this is glass, and then that's just... decorative, I guess. Decorative bottomless pit. I see a catwalk up there. What do these buttons do? Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Also, I can portal up there. I just noticed that. Well, oh, sort of. So there is the companion cube. And there is the assistant cube, I suppose? Kinda? Am I supposed to make, like, a circle jump here? Cause I'm not good at I don't even think I've ever done a circle jump, ever. Also, this glass... This glass is again the- the slippery glass. This is really slippery for some reason. Okay, so what is, uh... This other picture? That is the companion cube. Okay. Strange. I guess I'm supposed to air strafe or something? Cause Deathwish did make this after I did the weird air strafing stuff in, uh... In the, uh, the open and closed door policy video. Okay, well that was kind of... kind of the right idea. Right? I mean, it felt like it anyway. I don't really know what I'm doing. I... I, I suck at air strafing. Hey! Somehow I did it. And it just fell off. Well, what was the point of that? No, <laughs> Well, no, really, was I supposed to, like, jump up there or something? What was the point of that? What did I just do that for? I landed on it. And it fell. Is that supposed to be a reference to, uh... What was the one by M.T.? Cube shall not pass. Is that a reference to cube shall not pass? Well, now I don't understand how to even get over here. And also, this doesn't- this is not portable, it's just- it's just a thing that is there. There's no way to jump over the railing, to my knowledge. Unless you do that! <laughs> I guess that works too, I- I didn't consider that. Okay, this one auto-responds, right? Let's- let's find out. Yes, it does. That turns off that fizzler over here, right? This does not auto-respawn. Alright. I kinda feel like I've already messed up by knocking that thing down. I think that once I land on it, I'm supposed to jump immediately, so that I don't... screw myself over. I don't think I can make the jump from here. I might be able to, but no, no. Yeah, the ceiling is right here. All I can do is just walk off and fall. I think I screwed myself. <laughs> There's literally nothing I can do right now. Except restart. Rage suppression. I don't really get rage that much. Alright, this time... There we go. Get that done right away. Alright, so... How about we just toss this over there already? There we go. Now it's already there for us. Oh! 
Well, then what's the gel for? Can I just walk down here? Yeah, I can. Okay. <laughs> what was the purpose of that? I, I really do not understand what Deathless is going for here, but, uh, I did the map. <laughs> Alright. Well guys, as always, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it, and you can show your appreciation with the two buttons below the video that look like these right here. <laughs> I like how many underscores are crossing out, crossing out the death in Deathwish. Goodbye!